Hi guys, welcome back to my channel Alib Math Blog. So today, today our question is: If x plus one over x is equal to minus one, then find the value of x to the power x plus one over x to the power x is equal to how much? So student, in this video, I will tell you how to find the value of x to the power x plus one over x to the power x from this equation. So my dear student, our given algebraic equation is x plus one over x is equal to minus one, and we have to find the value of x to the power x plus one over x to the power x from this equation. So student, to find the value of this algebraic expression from this equation, so on the left hand side we have to simplify x plus one over x. Okay, in first term. In the place of denominator, there is no number, so we have to take one in the place of denominator. And after that, we have to write the division line. And in, in the, the place of denominator, we have to write the LCM of one and x. The LCM of one and x is x. So we have to write x in the place of denominator. And in the place of numerator, we have to write x square plus one. Is equal to on the right hand side. Again, we have to write minus one. Okay, student. So after that, my dear student. So after that, we have to apply the cross multiplication rule on this equation. Okay. So on the left hand side, we have to write x square plus one is equal to on the right hand side. We have to write x into minus one. That is minus six. Okay. So after that, my dear student, minus x we have to transpose from right side to left hand side. So on the left hand side, we have to write x square plus x plus one is equal to zero. So student, to find the value of x from this equation, so we have to multiply left hand side and right hand side of this equation by x minus one. Okay. So on the left hand side, we have to write x minus one into x square plus x plus one is equal to. On the right hand side, we have to write zero into x minus one. Okay. So after that, my dear student. So on the left hand side, now we have to apply the formula. A Q minus B Q is equal to. A minus B into A square plus AB plus B square. So this formula we have to apply on left hand side of this equation. So after apply this formula on the left hand side of this equation, so we can write in here x s q minus one is equal to on the right hand side. If you multiply x minus one with zero. Then you get zero. So that's why we have to write zero on the right hand side of this equation. Okay. So my dear student, after that, we can transpose minus one from left hand side to right hand side. So now we have to write on the left hand side x to the power three is equal to one. Okay. So student, to find the value of x from this equation, so we have to make the same power on both side. Okay. So on the So we can write from this equation x s q is equal to one to the power three. One to the power three that means one. Okay, in the place of one we can write one to the power three. If you multiply three times one, then you get one. So that's why in the place of one we can write one to the power three. Okay. So after that, my dear student, now we have to apply the formula a to the power m is equal to b to the power m. implies that a is equal to b so this formula we have to apply on this equation okay so on the both side on both side the power is same okay so we can cancel the power of this equation so we can write in here x is equal to 1 okay the value of x will be 1 so after that my dear student now we have to find the value of x to the power x plus 1 over x to the power x so now we can write in here x to the power x plus 1 over x to the power x 
so after that we have to put the value of x is equal to 1 in this algebraic expression then you get the value of this algebraic expression and so we can write in here 1 to the power 1 plus 1 over 1 to the power 1 okay so 1 to the power 1 that is 1 okay plus 1 over 1 to the power 1 okay that is 1 so student after that we can write from this algebraic expression 1 plus 1 divided by 1 that is 1 okay so 1 plus 1 that is 2 so my dear student the value of this algebraic expression will be 2 this is our final answer so my dear student our answer is complete and you like this video and if you like this trick so please support me and subscribe my channel thank you bye bye